For this video, I'm going to show you some books that I got at a library bag sale a couple days ago. Um, I really like the bag sales primarily because you're basically getting the books for free almost. Uh, these bags were $3 each and I bought five bags, so I basically spent $15 uh, for the entire day on these books and there's probably about 100 books right there. So it's a really great way to build up your inventory for just starting out. And you're on a budget. It's also a great way to build up your inventory if you're if you're an experienced bookseller and you just want to add more inventory. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you some books that I got. Um, the first one is by Stephen Johnson, uh, where good ideas come from. It's a lightweight paperback, and this has a really good rank of 9,000 and a low FBA price of 9.95. So after FBA fees, I'll make about five dollars on this one. And since I paid 15 cents for it, um, you know, it's not a bad deal. The next one is by George Chauncey, and it's called Why Marriage. And this one has a rank of 601000 and a low FBA price of $12. So once again, I'll make about $7 on this one after fees. And so since I paid 15 cents for it, uh, I'll be making about 6 or $7 profit on this one. So these are uh, my bread and butter type books. These are primarily what I'm looking for at bag sales, books that I can sell between $8 to $12 on FBA. Um, so that's what a lot of these books are right here. But occasionally I'll come across some higher value ones and I'll just go ahead and show you some of those that I found. Uh, this is called The Defense Speaks for History and the Future. As you can see, it's a lightweight paperback. And this one is... Uh, it does have a high rank of 2.1 million, but the low price is $104, and there's no FBA sellers, so I could probably price it um, higher than that uh, since I'll be doing FBA. So this will be more of a long-term investment since the rank is over 2 million, but since I'll be making more than $100, it's definitely worth um, uh, buying it. Next one is called Dream Seekers. This is a children's book. It's an also an ex-library book. And this one is has a rank of 1.6 million, so it is a bit high, but the low price is $50, and there's no FBA sellers. So once again, I could price this um, quite a bit higher since I'll be doing this on FBA. I might price this at $70 or so, maybe even higher. And uh, so once again, this is another long-term investment, but since I spent 15 cents on it, you know, I'm more than willing to wait for the sale. So I just want to show you some of those books. Uh, the library bag sale strategy is a great way to go. Uh, usually at the end of the, um, usually libraries have a uh, sale that lasts three days. At the end of it, they'll have a bag sale uh, just to get rid of all their books. And um, usually it's between three to five dollars a bag. So this is on the low end of three dollars. And uh, so I just want to show you um, some uh, examples of the books that I got. And if you want to know uh, the profit of this sale, go ahead and click on the link below and I'll send you an update after the first, second, third month um, how this particular sale did. I'll show you the profit, the storage fees, and what percent of the book sold, uh, just in case you're interested. And that's it for this video. Uh, thank you for watching.